Hey, good evening, folks. This is Steve Cow 5 jf Hope everyone's doing okay out there this evening. Got something I want to show you tonight on CW. Uh, the band is pretty much died. I've been calling CQ this afternoon, and nothing, nothing is, has been happening. But I wanted to show you a shortcut: how to use some of the pre-programmed uh, options that you can use in the radio for setting up pre-programmed messages, such as CQ, CQ, your call sign, uh, you know, QRZ, QRL is a frequency in use, those types of things. So let me uh, let, let's program a couple of them. The uh, the first thing you'll want to do is go to menu setup. Up, and you're going to look at options 18 through 22 and you always want to make sure these are all set to text see right there where it says text if you press select it'll go to message we want to make sure it's on text remember the dark purple is always the default all right now what we do is we want to press FM list and we want to make sure our word speed is about 13 because that's about where I normally send all right, then we're going to go back over here, and we're going to go to this screen that has memory on it. Now, I have done a video a long time ago where we did voice. We did voice on sideband, which is the same concept, but now we're going to use uh, this same, same function, but in the mode for CW. So when I press memory 1, it's going to come up with a screen. Now, what we want to do is we want, we're going to leave everything. We're going to leave that bracket there. That bracket has to be there. So we're going to put CQ, 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 KI5, JUF, KI5, J U F and we have to put that little closing symbol we want to put the K and then we want to press put that symbol right there now this whole message here when I press enter it's going to save it into the uh, memory location alright there's the message right there All right, so that is the first one. So let's program the next one. And what we'll do next is we'll go to memory. And the next one we'll have is QRL question mark. And then QRZ will be for your call sign again. So uh, let's try that. We'll go to memory 2. And now we're going to put in Q. Let's see. Move this all the way over here. Q R. Uh, we'll just put a space here. Q R L question mark is the frequency in use. Press enter. Whoops! It didn't save it. Uh, let's go back again. Oh, I forgot to put the closing statement. Q R L question mark and then I have to put that little closing bracket there press enter and let's play this one so is the frequency in use is the frequency in use pretty cool all right, let's go back and do number three is QRZ question mark. And we'll go over here. Q R Z question mark. And then we have to put the bracket. All right. So that's pretty cool. Now we'll do one more. Let's do uh, 
day okay this is uh these are actually preloaded in here 599k so they actually gave us a couple to work with uh let's um let's do one more uh let's do 73 uh let's do 73 here for a minute uh i, li I like to do this one here let's try this one Let's do 73, space, 73, uh, space, and then let's do the dit dit. And we got to put the closing bracket. <laughs> it it picked up a uh, a, a period, <laughs> so that's kind of embarrassing. So that's not going to work. All right. Well, it it what it did it picked it up as a period, not a dot dot. So I'll have to figure out how to send a dot dot. So we'll just take that out. That's kind of embarrassing, but we can leave that. Um, we can go in here and put uh, SK. That might be something there for the end, just to close out the QSO. Let's try that. All right, cool. All right, so what you have now is you have uh, these different program messages. So you have your your CQ, CQ, QRL is a frequency in use, uh, QRZ, can you come again with your call sign, uh, and of course the 73 uh, SK. So let's uh, let's 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 practice using these. Now the other thing I wanted to show you real quick is the words per minute. You've got to make sure you've got this set. Uh, like if you, whoops. If I set that to 23, and I go over here and I press my, it's going to go way too fast. Way too fast. All right, so we need to slow that down. So we go back over here to 13, which is about where I send, and uh, let that go there. We'll go back to our memory spots again. Alright, so what we'll do now is, the, there doesn't seem to be anyone on the frequency, we'll turn the break in on and let's give it a try. So if someone does answer us, we can we can come back and we can start working and we can say, uh, you know, we can say for example, let's just make up a call sign here. Uh, pull up my little note here. We just make up a call sign. And what you can do is you can immediately start working the station. So like if you get somebody that comes answer answer, you can just say, you know. You know that type of thing and you can say uh, you know for example you can say like let's do the the call sign k5 dog 
Juliet, Kangaroo, uh, uh, Y. Hey, we have a we have a station here. Let's see what's going on. All right, there's my call sign. Let's see if he comes back. It's not us. I thought it was me keying down. It's not us. So I'm putting out my call sign again. If I can just get him to come back with the call sign, we might be able to work him. No such luck. So let's go back to our memories. Let's try our QRZ. So we're asking him, can you send your call sign again? I'm tempted to go right here and see what's going on right here. See how the Zen brought him in? That's what the Zen does. Let's, let's, let's we'll go back here to where we were. That Zen will match his uh, transmit frequency with what my VFO is set for. All right, this may be something we might be able to work. See if we can. Let's see if the frequency is in use. QRL is a frequency in use. Yeah, let's just use our memory location one. All right, let's see if he answers. Nothing heard, nothing heard. Well, anyway, that uh, just wanted to show you how to do the memory thing. So that's how you can pre-program a couple of codes in there, like, you know, CQ, CQ, uh, QRZ, QRL. Uh, nothing going on here. Uh, what a bummer. Would have been fun to get a QSO here. Let's try our let's try us one more time. I'll use the key here. OK, 
Okay, we'll do it again. All right, maybe we'll get a QSO here. Boy, it's, it sure would be fun to have somebody come back to us. But it may not happen. I think the band has started to die. So anyway, I'll wrap this video up, and hey, we'll do some more uh, CQ calls later. 73. Alright, thanks guys.